applied to every business school in Canada. They all turned me down. I was looking at continuing with the job I had at the time, and then just the day before classes started, the University of Ottawa called and asked, was I still interested in attending the university, and could I come in for an interview that day? They accepted me on trial. That literally changed my life. I probably started fundraising when our youngest uh, went to a private school and they needed someone to help out uh, from one of their events. So that was probably the start. I decided to get involved with Alliance Gate Hospital. It's our local hospital. They needed help as far as raising funds to build a new hospital. So I've been doing that for a number of years. I was on the board at the hospital. I'm now an honorary chair member. When you get into a situation like that, you got to make some decisions. I always thought we'd always be okay. I mean, we have each other, we have our family, we're always going to be okay. Yeah, the most successful thing that happened to me in mining was the creation of a company called Wheaton River about 18 years ago that we took over Gold Corp and took their name and now it's Gold Corp. So from literally from nothing, we created Gold Corp. Gold Corp's a you know, very large philanthropist, not only in Vancouver and British Columbia, but across Canada. Uh, I think since we started Gold Corp, we've donated uh, over $100 million to different charities in that last uh, 17 years. A hundred years from now, I think the only thing they might write about us is that we were lucky to be in Canada, lucky to be in Vancouver, lucky to have a great family, and that we managed to give back a little bit.